Well, I, um, a lot has happened in my life, and uh, I was part of the financial crisis that happened in 2008. And I was out looking for work as well, um, and I, w I decided I had to go back to school, and I had to finish school. And when I went to finish school, I said, oh God, I've got to pay for this, i got to pay tuition, am I ready for this? So I started putting myself into a situation as a college kid, and I said, hey, you know what, maybe I need to look out there for scholarships. And I applied for scholarships, and I, got, I was searching the web, and I got a hit back from ISC Square. And I said, is this real? And I started looking, and and it says something about women's scholarship and undergrad scholarships and um, scholarships for masters and scholarships for, I said, wow. Um, so I talked to one of my colleagues at work and I said, I told, uh, I asked him, do you think I should apply? And he said, yeah, go for it. So uh, the, the hardest part was really telling my story because I, you know, you wanna kind of put that Aside, you don't really want people to know your struggles. Um, we all have our pride, so that well, that was the hardest part. I think once I got over that hump and just just came out with it and um, and just really told my situation, it's just uh, being selected was 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 um, you know the hardest part because I said, wow, I don't want to sound like a, you know like a sob story. But I, I do want to be honest, and, and I'm sure every, you know there's a lot of people that realize they're probably going through the same thing I was going through. So, uh, well, I love information security. I've always loved IT. Uh, when I started working at a financial company, that's when I really started to really like security and the power of security, and how when I was in a, a data administrator, system administrator. I, it was like everybody wanted to be my friend because they wanted access and you know I had this control even though from the corner of my little cubicle I was you know I was just uh, sitting there with all this power because I was this administrator and I think that um, that's when I really liked security and protecting data and how important it was to protect data so that's when I went to school I went to doing um, the cyber security and cyber and information systems and security management you know that that's that's the study that I'm going into the scholarship meant that they believed in me and which made me believe in myself even more um, you know it was it was an honor to be selected I didn't. I never thought I would be selected. Um, at being a woman in IT security is is hard enough. Um, I, I remember one of the guys at work would call me a lipstick geek. You know, I thought that was so cute. <laughs> and I, 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 because they were just surprised that I knew just as much as them. Um, but I wore lipstick, you know, or I like to style a little. Um, and I would love to get the word out there to the next generation of, of women uh, to, to do it. it. You know, we've got a new war out here, uh, a new battlefield, and um, it's the battlefield of cybercrime, and we can do it just the same way. Thumbs up. <laughs>